Hi, this is Gary, and welcome. You know, one of the best things about photography is being outdoors with friends who are into photography also, and sharing the adventure. This clip shows Christine, Mark, and I doing what we love to do in the great outdoors, shooting photographs. And in these short clips, you'll see us shooting in Colorado in some areas between Breckenridge and Aspen. So I hope you enjoy a quick look at shooting landscapes in the mountains. Wave at the camera, everyone. There you go. Yeah. This is Independence Pass, and we're on the It's very cold, very windy. <laughs> Straight ahead in nine months. Our wind here. Yeah. I'm here setting it up for a 
I go to the shop and get the water and ice this and then I set the timer or sub timer on the camera so it can pick up the vibrations and the motion. Yeah, I think it's starting to come in. Maybe it'll come across this way. Okay, what we're doing here is shooting the waterfall. In order to get a nice, silky, smooth look to the waterfall, you need to add a circular polarizer to your lens. Probably a, about a three-stop uh, neutral density grad bring down the exposure so you get that nice smooth feel. We're going to shoot it here and we'll show you how it comes out next. Now you can shoot it handheld, but the best thing to do is put it on a tripod like I have over here and shoot it there so it's nice and solid and you get a good smooth sharp picture. You got the polarizer on and... No, I took it off. Oh. Hmm. Oh. I can't do it without what? taking a picture. <laughs> you have to stick your finger up. <laughs> oh, I don't have to have it on there? No. Is that focus? Well, to focus, yeah. <laughs> but... <laughs> As you can see, we have a lot of fun. Thanks for watching.